Hello everyone. So today in this lecture we will be discussing about what are the different kinds of research study designs. or epidemiological studies so broadly the epidemiological studies can be divided into two categories based on what based on whether the exposure was assigned by the investigator if the exposure is assigned then it is an experimental study or otherwise it is known as interventional study so this experimental study or interventional study can be further of two kinds basing on whether random allocation was done or not if random allocation was not done then it is called as non randomized control trial if the random allocation was done then it is called as randomized control trial now if the exposure was not assigned by the investigator then it is called as an observational study observational study then observational study can be divided into two kinds of study basing on what basing on whether there was a comparison group or not okay if there is no comparison group then this this is called as an descriptive study if there is a comparison group then it is called as analytical study the descriptive study can be further divided into whether it is based on individual or population so in case of individual it can be case report it can be case series or it can be a cross sectional survey if the sample is a population it is an ecological study now the analytical study can be divided into three categories basing on the direction of study so if the direction is from exposure to outcome then these are called as cohort study if the dis, no, direction is from outcome to exposure then it is called as case control study then if the exposure and outcome occur at the same time exposure and outcome are found at the 
सेम टाइम सेम टाइम देन इट इज क्रॉस सेक्शनल एनालिटिकल ओके सो दिस इज द क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ द रिसर्च स्टडी डिजाइन और द एपिडेमोलॉजिकल स्टडी सो बेसिंग ऑन whether the exposure is assigned yes or not then it can be divided into either experimental study or observational study if the exposure is assigned then it is called as experimental study if the exposure is not assigned it is called as observational study then the experimental study can be divided into two categories based on whether the random allocation was done or not if the random allocation was done it is called as randomized control trial if the random allocation was not done it is called as non randomized control trial now the observational study it can be further divided into two categories basing on whether there was a comparison group or not if there is no comparison group it is called as descriptive study if there is a comparison group it is called as analytical study so the analytical study can be further divided into three categories basing on what basing on the direction of the study if the direction of the study is from exposure to outcome then it is called as cohort study if the direction of the study is from outcome to exposure then it is called as case control study if the direction and out, if the direction is such that the exposure and outcome occur at the same time that that means it takes a snapshot of the population which is being studied then it is called as cross sectional study the descriptive studies then they can be further divided into basing on whether the sample is an individual or it is a population if the sample is individual it can be case reports case studies or case series and cross sectional surveys if the sample is a population then it is an ecological study so that's all about the various study designs or epidemiological studies we will further dis discuss the different study studies in details in future lectures